why kerala is called god's own country according to the hindu mythology lord parshurama who was an avatar of vishnu once threw his axe from kanyakumari towards the north and thus a land arose from the ocean which is now known as kerala this story is literally makes kerala god's own country kerala in the southwestern region of india is often referred to as god's own country this beautiful land is rightly called as the paradise given to its lush green scenic landscapes and crystal clear beaches that will leave you awestruck the phrase god's own country however is not an absolute meaning was adopted as a slogan by the tourism department of the state government in the 1980s when it was relatively unknown for promoting its tourism activities in addition to making campaigns to boost the industry god's own country was coined by a leading ad agency for kerala tourism board to make the state every tourist dream destination and it did do wonders to kerala's revenue it is considered one of the marketing media successes kerala located in south india in an extraordinary land with almost all elements of nature kerala is the 100% literate state in india is also famous for tour and tourism poets wrote poems about this state and many writers find hard to express the full beauty of this place kerala is nestled between the pristine waters of the arabian sea on the west and the lush western ghat mountains on the east its intense network of rivers and lagoons thick forests exotic wildlife tranquil stretches of emerald backwaters and along the shoreline of serene beaches make it a traveler's paradise ghat's own country paradise the rich cultural heritage the dance form and the essence of music are so impressive that the tourist will be spellbound by the magic features of kerala the houseboats are one of the main attractions of the country driving all the people from around the world especially to hop on to one of those boats the boats offer a peaceful time together and also is a romantic jackpot thing for all those couples out there kerala totally believes in the ancient ayurvedic medicine there are number of ashramas rejuvenation and relaxation therapies for the tourists they are made available by various methods of ayurveda like meditation yoga massage for the well being of the tourists there are many traditions that are still being followed just to make sure they hand over the rich values to generations to come it has also preserved the ancient art of martial arts known as kalari payattu